Hey guys, Howard Partridge here. Uh, been seven days since Hurricane Ike, and and I'm uh, here with my friend uh, Buddy McClellan, who's in the Knights of the Round Table. We still have no power, still have no water. We tried to hook my well up to the generator, and between the two of us, I don't know, we just can't get it working. So we got somebody to work on that today. But uh, Buddy has a truck mount here, and we got to talking about Bubba and uh, about the, how the fact is is that he ain't got no water either but he does have a truck mount and uh, so he was able to uh, hook up a shower so we ought to be able to do the same thing so buddy how's the shower system going to work here uh, it's just coming from the truck mount and we have velcro that'll keep the lever on so when you're finished with the shower you just unvelcro it and uh, turns it off and all right so all right so uh turn it on let me see how it works All right, cool. Okay, great, you can turn it off now. Now you're in the Knights of the Round Table and speak loud for the camera so they can hear you. Oh, by the way, we got some uh, Hula Girl shower. bath and shower gel. This is gonna be fun, y'all. Uh, so you're in the Knights of the Round Table and tell these folks why they ought to be in the Knights of the Round Table too. Uh, it's one of the most outstanding experiences that you can possibly have mainly because of a little, little underlying uh, preposition underneath everything that happens at the nights, and it's called servanthood. You don't just get people handing you programs and saying, here you go, do this, do that, do the other. You get a service. You get uh, a heart. You get people that actually put themselves wanting you to succeed and helping you do that, they go out of their way to make sure if you have a problem or have uh, different kind of things that develop, they don't leave you just hanging. They actually go the extra mile to make sure that uh, you're taken care of and that uh, things go smoothly for your business. And your business does succeed. Uh, with all the different programs that Howard has available, uh, he takes you from, if you don't know anything, or if you do know a lot, he'll help you tweak your program to get it to the next level. And there's so many different ones within the Knights that also can help and they all kind of join together and they all have that servanthood heart where they're willing to just go the extra mile and, and help you overcome problems, look at your program, tweak it, develop it, and work with you on that. So um, it's really not too hard of a choice to make and any money that you spend uh, you just get abundantly over uh, as the Bible says when your cup runneth over well this one runs over and just keeps flowing so uh, it's really wasn't very hard decision once you meet the different people that are in the group uh, see how they're kind of like a big family working together helping each other lifting each other up being accountable to each other uh, it really is a good experience. That's great. We're so happy to have you in the nights. In fact, the reason that Buddy's down here is we had Hurricane Ike right here in Houston. We got power at our office yesterday, the hotel where we're having the round table. Their power was out maybe 20 minutes and they're not even sure it was that long. No damage whatsoever on that side of the town. Of town. It was good. But anyway, the reason that Buddy's down here is because uh, he's down here doing restoration and serving our clients and getting their homes and businesses dried out and everything. So again, being in the right nights of the round table, one of the things that I appreciate is all of you guys are there to help us. So it kind of goes both ways and we, uh, we all win. And uh, like Zig Ziglar says, you can have everything you want in life if you just help enough other people get what it is that they want. And so Buddy's helped me uh, get a shower. Now I had the idea, I got plenty of truck mounts, but I didn't take the time to bring it over here and hook it up. So let's see how this thing's going to work here. Okay, hopefully I've got it not set too hot. <laughs> All right, thanks guys. Y'all have a good day. Hey! Hey, look at here, we got a tarp. We have to well, yo, yo, wait, wait. <laughs> this is my brother James. He's in town too. Anybody else want to come stay with me? I, I don't know. Come on over. But uh, listen, we're charging for showers. I'm next. So you, you, you're going to have to shower. wait. <laughs> Shit, I'm charging 10 bucks, man. Raise your price. <laughs> All 
Oh, here I got to get a shot of me jumping under there. So we'll just we'll just we'll clip it. There we go. We can. Do need to warm up a little bit? We can add it. Yeah. It's not. Y'all are gonna shower together? <laughs> yeah, right. That's what people are gonna be saying. I don't know about the three boys back there. Where's his wife at? When you're a carpet cleaner, you can do anything. That's right. Listen, when you got a truck like yours, you got a home, you got water. Woo! Carpet cleaners are never without a shower. Uh, or post mobile cleaner unit. <laughs>